Hello, it's Sarah D. Carnes here to talk about change. People tend to have a love-hate relationship with change, and I get it. It can feel pretty scary. There are unknowns around any corner, and if indeed we're looking at making a change, we will do our best to try to grasp every bit of information we can. And that can be helpful, and sometimes it makes us hold our breath a little more. It makes us feel a little more scared. It makes us try to manipulate or control the changes. And sometimes we can't do that. In fact, most of the time we can't control or manipulate. We're going to have to roll with it and be resilient. So three things I will say about change. One is you're going to have to let go of the old version of you. You can't always make it about what's going on outside of you, but if you let go of being too attached to the old version of you, you will find a lot more grace embracing and welcoming the new version of you in relationship with that change on the outside. The second thing is you will need to own your breathing space. And most of us don't do that to the extent we could. I have breathing space in how I breathe in my body. Even if I don't have a lot of physical space around me, I'm in control of my breathing space. And you need that. The third piece is changes our reboot and upgrade. Our computers need this regularly and we don't question it there. We do tend to question it when it's something happening in our life, our body or our life or our children or our relationships. And the good news is there are practical ways to reclaim your resilience and your reboot ability. And you will appreciate coming out the other side, be able to enjoy it, have a lot more courage, clarity, and confidence.